before that let me share the uh, one document and just update updating it i am also sharing this in our shared folder so that you will also have access to it so the template which uses single template that means you will only able to modify it you will not able to create multiple versions will be supplier request project template supplier self registration request template this will be available where external supplier request feature is enabled by the client that time only this piece, this template will be available for the users don't forget to subscribe our channel and click on bell icon to update yourself with latest sap videos next supplier registration template so one template for request one template for registration one template for qualification and one template for preferred supplier and one template for disqualification all these uh sorry uh whatever the projects we are creating all will be in uh, template based only then the multiple templates option will be under sm modular question ir which is not related to any of the process which will be a stand alone kind of a question ir which you want to work with your suppliers to gather information either for your analysis or to make uh, like performance module uh, performance evaluation you can use this modular question ir then the second process will be sm process project this will only be active if their uh, client is having flexible process framework is enabled in that case supplier qualifications are managed using this process it will not be available under normal template that will be done using process project okay in order to create uh, access to the template you need to be a role of template creator role or in the group when you are going to the users in administration user manager group there you need to select template creator under that you can add yourself as a member or you user under user edit the user and add the groups there you need to add this template creator permission otherwise you need to have access from template project template creator team group what is the trip i will just show you now and the second one is sm modular question ir manager this role is required if you want to access modular question ir templates then you need to have sm modular question ir manager role in order to access this modular question ir supply registration and modular question ir at the only supplier manager process that support template upgrade there is also a feature which says that template upgrade what is meant by template upgrade is you are seeing contract workspaces which we are creating so the contract workspace when we are created the template is having a button Question say four. So someone is creating a contract workspace. It will use template version four. And later the template version got updated. Say for example now it is six, but this change will not affect existing workspaces already created. So that means whatever your new workspace is getting created that will use the latest version the ones which already created will use the fourth version only so when the template will be upgraded to the sixth version so whenever the contract workspace is amended that time we can force we can force the user to use updated template it is also possible it is defined uh, customization by as or we need to rise to sr so we can there is a parameter to enable it if that parameter is enabled we can force all the users to use updated template only if that is not enabled then at the time of amendment user is provided with an option i think i have shown this one when we are doing amendments in contract also so do you want to update to latest template or create using existing template actually it will not ask you to create exist it will say if you are saying yes that will be upgraded to the latest if you are saying no it will still work based on template version 4 only so like that only contract workspace is will be updated during amendment only otherwise it will not update it. but ariba has provided a new feature why i am saying new is earlier i have not heard this one now only i came to know that ariba has introduced you can up Great. Your templates only 
what are the templates is supplier request tem sorry registration templates registration template and sm modular so these two templates can be upgraded or updated to the updated version of the template by posing the user so for example you have collected a information from your supplier saying 1 2 3 4 now you your company has requested for example vat or some tax was introduced in india that has to be mandatory updated by the supplier you need to know their gst in id or some id so you want to inform all the users please update tax information okay so instead of doing each and one 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 project separately what you can do is you can go to the registration template and amend the question with the five please update tax information so you are requesting one more uh, uh, question raising with the supplier then once you up, click on that update option what will happen is the registration template is kept open for the supplier to enter the details so they can enter the details with the, the edit functionality will be available for the user supplier to enter it so then all the supplies can be updated using a single instance instead of doing multiple they can update in one place itself if supplier registration template you do not want to touch you can use the modular questionnaire where you will send the stand alone the templates to all the suppliers to respond and they can update to the updated version the advantage is so you have a uniform the structure a uniform actually uh, just uh, let's pause here for a second and try to understand the fundamental difference between uh supplier registration project template this we know that you know like especially when you click on the invite button the questions which go with the registration then uh supplier sm modular questionnaire what uh, what is the fundamental difference between these two when this modular questionnaire is coming into play yeah, yeah i'll come to that it's a good question i think yesterday i explained but maybe not you know not noted down what is happening is supplier request project if supplier is accepted it says the status is invited yes okay and uh, once registration is done you will see registered supplier correct correct so their yes. status also getting updated based on the responses or based on the questionnaire which are the projects which they have started and we have completed correct then yes here also you will be having qualified qualified so he is qualified for is commodity region yes similarly you are also making him preferred supplier don't forget to subscribe our channel and click on bell icon to update yourself with latest sap videos yes then you are also disqualifying him later stage if you found he is not uh, yes. whatever be the reason so here Agreed. the status is getting affected if you are changing anything equal and status also need to be updated but yes. modular questionnaire is suppose you want to collect a question sm modular questionnaire you want to collect iso certification information mm -hmm. which will give you date of issue date of expiry who uh, issued something like that issue or date If you have something like this. so all the certification we have these details this is an ongoing process after certain each supplier will have different different validity so once it is expired you want to maintain or you want to search the contract expiry you want to inform your supplier so issue here sorry uh, here the date of expiry you want to send a reminder to the user now it is going to expect the seller the supplier so please update your information this will be kept open because you are not going to change any of the status that is the reason mm -hmm. you are using modular questionnaire it has many options also not only this this you can use for what is called uh, grading the supplier also supplier or evaluating supplier here maybe you can ask a question like uh this you can send for